Hello my friends. Today we're going to look at a radio that I picked up and I should uh, put a disclaimer here to let you know that these were not sent to me by Redivis so I don't do a review for Redivis or for anybody else. I actually bought these because I needed a multi-unit radio on FRS frequencies that I could use without a license that looked solid and reliable. These are the Redivis R21 FRS radio. Like all Redivis units, it's pretty solid. I like the feel of this. It looks a lot nicer and better and feels much better in the hand than the standard 888s. I think it's just basically an upgrade of the 888s. Functionality is pretty much One. the same way. You're going to get the channels. The voice Two. is going to tell you what channel you're on. Five. It does have One. scanning capability. It's pretty neat for a little radio. Antennas are fixed on them. You cannot remove the antenna. Uh, they seem to be kind of like, I'm not too sure, pinned in there, so you cannot twist the antenna and remove it. Because it is an FRS radio and because it is FCC approved, uh, it has to have a fixed antenna, so it cannot be removed. But otherwise, it's a good feeling radio in the hand. It's very solid. They do come with belt clips, earpieces, chargers, so pretty much everything you would need to get going. Matter of fact, what's interesting is these always come pre-charged, so you can use them right out of the box right away. Uh, I've been pretty pleased with these radios. They're fairly solid. They are fully programmable and can be fully accessed and programmed via Chirp if you have the cable form. It's a standard Balfang cable, um, standard industry 2-pin. One nice feature about these radios, however, is these actually have a scrambler, which is kind of surprising because every other radio I bought that had a scrambler did not work as a scrambler. These do actually have a scrambler in them. And for uh, my European friends, these are also available in PMR446 uh, in the same arrangement. Uh, as a matter of fact, these can be reprogrammed to PMR446. Uh, in fact, I have a pair that I programmed to PMR446 uh, frequencies for Europe. Uh, obviously, I cannot turn it on and show it to you because that frequency is not to be used outside of Europe. And since I'm outside of Europe, I cannot use that frequency to show you how that works. But let me show you uh, what the scrambler is like and what it sounds like. I think these radios are a great bargain. Uh, you can buy them in single units, a pair, a package of four, a package of five, or even a package of ten if you so desire. Uh, they'll vary in prices. You'd have to shop around between Alibaba, Banggood, or Amazon. They're available on Amazon usually for uh, around $50 for the pair of them, and I think they're quite worth their money. So that's all I have on these. Uh, again, just a quick review. I don't like to delve into too many details. Uh, thanks for watching.